Sponsored by RxCardClub.com. Get a free prescription drug card and save up to 85% on prescription drugs. RxCardClub.com. High school league in no rush to push back football season in Helene aftermath, as communities in the upstate and Midlands continue to recover from the devastating effects of Hurricane Helene, the status of the high school football season for many schools remains in limbo. South Carolina had about 20 high school games postponed or cancelled last week, while some games were moved to Wednesday, Saturday, and Monday. But with a lack of electricity and other issues, including debris, some schools in the state will not be able to play this Friday night, on October 4. There has been discussion around the state about the possibility of extending the high school season by a week, which would mean a later start to the state playoffs. Those schools that might need to make up games would do so during a bye week tacked on to the end of the season, while schools that played all of their regular season games would have an extra week to prepare for the playoffs. SC High School League Commissioner Dr. Jerome Singleton is no need to rush into such a decision until more time passes to see how many games are actually impacted. Right now, we are monitoring things and seeing the after-effects, Singleton said in an email. I don't want a knee-jerk reaction. Let's see how it shapes up. Right now, if we can play this coming Friday, we will. If we can't, then we won't. Any decision that needs to be made, I don't see the urgency to make it now and then have to change. We still have a lot of regular season still in play, so it would be premature step out and come up with something. Philip Simmons High School head coach Eric Bendig is fully on board with any decision to push back the season if needed, to help teams in the upstate and Midlands. I have no problem with it at all, Bendig said. I have a lot of friends coaching in the upper part of the state and I know things are bad for many of them. I know when we have had our storms down here and we needed to move things, the folks in the other parts of the state fully supported us. I totally support whatever needs to be done to give everyone a full season. Today's top headlines. Story continues below. Clemson blasted for holding football game in aftermath of Helene. University now cancels classes. Too many trees to count, Aiken, Augusta golf courses face damage from tropical storm Helene they put their Myrtle Beach area house on the market in April. Helene knocked a oak on it. Beaufort County tries to get back to normal after tropical storm Helene after Helene, upstate SC restaurants lose product and revenue. They still found a way to serve. 